but m can cover a distance of 120 kilometers downstream n hours hours undal and 144 kilometers upstream in n plus 4 hours the respective ratio between the speeds of the boat in still water to the speed of the boat downstream is 5 is to 6 find the time taken by the boat in against the stream 96 kilometers right what is boat speed here five parts and what is six parts that means m plus s is equal to six parts m is equal to five parts then s is equal to one part now 120 kilometers covered in downstream right then time to cover 120 kilometers in downstream is 120 by six parts only next 144 kilometers covered in upstream right upstream speed is equal to four parts time taken in upstream is n plus 4 time taken in downstream is then difference in time is 4 hours yes for how many times 36 6 how many times 20 times so 16 by p is equal to 4 from this p is equal to 4 now what exactly is the question time to cover 96 kilometers in upstream upstream speed is four parts only which is 16 how many times ide question is cheyakunda kuda cheppachu but multiple options are here i'll tell you the logic it may work for some other question but not for this now finally we were asked to calculate time to cover 96 kilometers in upstream upstream speed is equal to four parts only for how many times 20 by p and this is what your final answer correct your answer is going to be factor of 24 your answer must be factor of 24 yes 8 is a factor 6 is a factor 4 is a factor three options are there if there is only one option which is a factor of 24 you don't have to solve the question you're done with it but as multiple options are there we solved it 